Now let's see the next question. Next question we have a uniform meter rule. Meter rule means 100 centimeter rule. Rests horizontally on a knife edge at 60 centimeter. Knife edge or we can say that fixed point is there which is at 60 centimeter mark. When the mass of 10 gram is suspended from one end means from the one end 10, ma 10 gram mass is suspended that I don't know from which end. So we have to draw the arrangement and we have to find at which end this mass be suspended and what is the mass of the rule. So now let's see for example we have a uniform meter rule. Meter rule means I have 100 centimeter. Okay so meter rule means total length is 100 centimeter. So for example this is mark 0 centimeter and at the last we have 100 centimeter. So now we have to see that knife edge is at 60 centimeter. So 60 centimeter for example this is the center 50 centimeter. So 60 centimeter is here. So 60 centimeter we have a knife edge or fixed point. So now we have to attach a 10 gram. First of all we have to think where the weight of the body or where the weight of this uniform meter rule act. Uniform meter rule ka weight kis point pe act karega? At the center. So 100 centimeter ka center kya hai? 50. So here at the 50, at the 50 I got this weight and weight we know that is equals to mg. Okay. Ab uske baad dekhte hai, where we have to attach this 10 gram. So this 10 gram mass is uh, attaching in such a way that this whole meter rule is balanced. So this weight is creating which moment clockwise or anti-clockwise. So it is creating anti-clockwise. So we have to attach a mass in such a way that it is creating a clockwise movement. So clockwise movement kahan pe milega? Obviously on the opposite side. So here I have to attach the mass that is 10 GF. Okay. So how I got 10 GF? We know that weight is equals to M into G. So mass I know got 10 gram and G value is as it is. So it is in gram. So that's why I have taken G as 980. But actually I'm not putting the value. If I'm not putting the value, I got the answer in 10 gram force. Okay, so 10 GF is my answer. So now what I have to do, I have to take clockwise movement is equal to anti clockwise movement. So clockwise movement is equals to anti clockwise movement okay so now let's see who is creating clockwise movement this 10 gram force is creating clockwise movement so that is force into perpendicular distance force though i know 10 gram force 10 into g you can write and perpendicular distance just see this is at 100 centimeter this is at 60 centimeter so how much is this distance one minute how much is this distance if it is 100 centimeter and this is 60 so that I know you have calculated in mind but I have to write properly so 100 minus 60 anti-clockwise movement who is creating this W weight force is acting mg and distance in this case is so 60 and 50 60 minus 50 so here I got 10 into g into 40 and m into g into 10 so now cancel G and G cancel out 10 and 10 cancel out. So weight or mass of this rule I got mass of this rule I got 40 gram. Okay. So mass I got 40 gram and at which end at the B point or you can also write say that the left right side of fulcrum right side of fulcrum or right side of knife edge you can write so this is my answer